Hello guys. Just before I go, King's Church, still closed. It's meant to be uh, Thursday night and it's meant to be um, their like dinner thing and it's still closed. Um, so anyway, my, I was gonna write pharmacist, but I couldn't actually spell pharmacist on, on, on thinking out aloud. So I put chemist rather than pharmacist. But basically, the pharmacist. So I just had a conversation with my pharmacist about Black Lives Matter. Again, he's not a black man. He's a Gandian. He is West Indian. So I'm going to continue on this whole Black Lives Matter when you matter to get to know their culture and where they are actually really from. Um, and yes, they do matter. Black lives do matter. But I'm going to tell you again, racism calls them the black man. Fear calls them the black man. Educated people take the time to learn where their culture is from. And even if they're born here in Britain, where their heritage is from, where their, um, where their true roots come from. So my pharmacist is not a black man. He's a Gandian, and he's a very lovely Gandian man at that. And he has given me some advice, and he believes, just like me, that it's a catch-22 now between me um, naturally treating my children to having to blend within the pharmacy. But like he, even he said, you know, he said, you're right to ask the question that you've just answered, asked because if you use these creams for longer than you need to, then obviously it thins the skin and then they end up with proper full-term dermatological eczema and things like that. But unfortunately, the pharmaceutical people and people like Bill Gates and the people that are up the top with the pharmacies you, they, they make shit loads of money out of this stuff. They make absolute horrendous amounts of money out of this stuff. And people just don't question it. People, we, we are not qualified or experienced to know, yeah, whether or not we are having to ring 999 or two Americans 111. Um, we are not qualified to make the decision on whether or not we can actually spread a said virus. These guys in this truck, by the way, um, I just passed them a minute ago. They don't wear gloves and masks when they're seating together, just like the pharmacist doesn't. Um, so we, in certain areas, become, what's the word? We become reliant on those that are qualified those that are experienced, those that... Hello, are you? Oh, look at him. Oh, you, he's so big. Oh, you've got a little bit of a basketball fan there. Right, I'm waiting for you to get downstairs. <laughs> um, I'm going to miss this place in some ways. I am. It, 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 it's been a difficult one because... Um, just the weekends. Um, yeah, it, it, it's a difficult one, isn't it? You know, um, it's my community, but there is a difference between community and your personal friends, like the people here on my crack book. Um, you're not the people that, in a minute, I'm gonna go upstairs and, you know, we're gonna be making sure that Shiloh, he's okay, I might as well go upstairs. And, um, you know, uh, and, and pulling off our normal day-to-day -day things. In fact, we're working really, to, really well together at the moment, pulling this off. Sometimes it takes a sick child, doesn't it? So, uh, but he's not sick. He's just, he's an EDS kid. And um, I think we've just pr proved it because this is exactly what Faith went through. This is exactly what started it with Faith. Um, that I went back to the doctors 
And then obviously they were going, but she's not EDS. This is the other side of it, nursery and school and all of that, because they have to have formal diagnosis in order to treat your child. So unless your child has, a, even if it's like say, no, you can't give my child milk, well then they have to know why you can't give your child milk. And it's not, you can't educate the world about health because we've been, it's been so ingrained into us that this is the way. Get this thermocream cream, not so bad, you know, I get it, but, you know, to start giving my kids Pyroton already, no, 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 no. It's good to bring it down, but it's not the right way. So I want to get back to natural living and hopefully have the opportunity to have my own land, grow my own veg and live my way, life the way I want to live it, instead of this systematic bullshit. So anyway, I'm going in, and uh, this is the note to privacy, and uh, we're building our personal boundaries more and more and more, so I shall see you.